What's up, fam? So today I'm going to be showing you guys how I make my dry rub baked chicken. Today's recipe is going to be featuring Suchi's barbecue rub, and it's absolutely delicious, and I really think you guys are going to enjoy this video. All right, so I started out with some uh, leg quarters that I um, let soak in like a white vinegar water solution uh, just to get all the extra gunk off. And um, then I seasoned them up with the rub and some olive oil, placed them in a dish just like so. You know what I'm saying? Just like that. And then I covered the dish with some aluminum foil. You want to do that. This is an important step because you want to trap that heat. It really helps tenderize the chicken and allow the juices to kind of, you know, mingle with that rub, guys. So make sure you seal your pan. All right, I preheated the oven to 400 degrees. I meant to say that at the beginning. And then I put the chicken in there for approximately an hour to an hour and a half. This is what it looks like when you pull it out. And, um... It's not the last step. All right, guys, so I took about a quarter of that uh, drippings that was in that pan. Really, I used a fat separator just to get the fat off. And then I added some Dijon mustard, added some white vinegar, and I actually added some yellow mustard as well just to um, make a solution that I'm going to baste this chicken with, you know, kind of like a mop sauce, so to speak. So, yeah, I kind of mixed that up. I added a little bit, like I said, some more yellow mustard and um, just to get it right, just to get the flavor compound that I wanted. And this is what it ended up looking like. You see, kind of thick, but not too thick. All right, guys, like I said, so I mopped that um, chicken with that solution just like so, get it nice and kind of saturated. Then I took the barbecue rub and I just went back over it. Trust me, guys, it's not too salty. I went back in the oven for about um, 30 minutes or so at 350. I reduced the heat because I didn't want the chicken to burn. And um, you're gonna get a nice crust on there just like so. Absolutely delicious. Trust me on this. That rub is perfect. It's not too salty, so don't be stingy with it. And then this is the finished product. You know what I'm saying? I put it on a plate so you guys can see it a lot better. Trust me, guys. It, you see how the meat pulled back from the bone on the edge on the leg? Absolutely delicious. Really hope you guys enjoy this mukbang. See you soon. Hey, guys. Welcome back to our channel. I'm AJ. This is Danny, and we are hashtag. 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 Hashtag the kettle. CCTV. All right, guys, welcome back to our eating show. Sure. All right, guys, today we're back with another mukbang. And today, guys, we'll be having some good old, some good old roasted baked chicken, whatever you want to call it, guys. This is dry rub chicken. Also, we have some elotes, you know, Mexican street corn, but it's kind of done my way. We want to kind of like barbecue fashion. Also, guys, we have a little bit of rice, it's like a, a, um, a creamy chicken rice mm. that I came up with. It's really delicious. But anyway, guys. We're gonna get into this video, all that, but Nan's gonna hit you with a couple things. If this is your first time on our channel, don't forget to hit that subscribe button. And after, hit that post notification bell so that you're notified every time we upload. And give this video a thumbs up, like it. That's right, guys. Remember, guys, hit that button, hit that bell. Make sure you become a part of the family. Remember, hashtag grow, baby, grow. Hashtag the is moving closer. I go to 25K. If you're new here, welcome. If you've been here before, welcome back. Also, guys, we'd like to shout out to Suchi's. I don't. So cheese, spices. This is the uh, seasoning that we use today on this dry rub chicken. Also, I'll put a little bit on the corn, guys. This is going to be showcased in our video today. I've actually tasted it before. It is really, really good. I would like you guys to go over to their website, which we will place on the screen right here. Guys, make sure you check them out. Also, guys, look in the description box for all the information on how to purchase this. Barbecue dry rub is what we're using today. Suchi's barbecue rub, it is absolutely delicious, guys. It can go on pork, chicken, vegetables, anything you'd like to use it on. Beans, greens, potatoes, tomatoes, lamb, rams, hogs, dogs, chicken, turkeys, rabbits, you name it! Trust me, I'm not gonna endorse anything that I do not like. This is, we use it on this chicken today. It's absolutely delicious. I'm pretty sure you guys saw the recipe portion at the beginning of the video. Like I said, if you'd like to get more from Suchi's or taste this rub or any of their other seasonings, just look in the description box for the information and check them out. 
All right, guys, I'm going to go ahead and pray. Then we're going to get in this video. Father God, in the name of Jesus, we ask that you bless this food, Lord. Let it be nourishing to our bodies. Bless those who are less fortunate. All these things we ask in your name. Hey. Amen. Amen. Woo. Chicken, chicken. Woo. I don't know what I want first. I don't know. You want me to scoop this right out? Yeah. Put it in front of you. Put it, put it in my corner. <clears throat> Thank you. Uh -huh, I'm gonna push this on over. Push. push it on up front so it's out of my way. This Guys. rice is right here in my face. Let me see if y'all can. Whoa. I'm scared it's gonna Good. break. Can y'all see that? Mm-hmm. Yes. Look at this, y'all. Bring me a chicken. Look at this, y'all. Uh-huh. That's fine. Right. My whole bone done came out. <laughs> mm. I had a side piece without anything on it first. Mm-hmm. Let's put it up. Mm, look at that. Look at that, y'all. Bone slip right out. Shut your mouth. Not shut your mouth. Y'all, when I tell you, mm. the rub is really good because mm -hmm. it has, it's like, it has like an indescribable flavor, but you get a little sweetness and there's a kick but it's not salty. As much as I use, believe it or not, it is not salty. It's very flavorful. Look at that, I can't even pick up my chicken. <laughs> That's the way you like it. Right, I can't right. do it. That's the way, uh-huh, uh-huh. <laughs> mm. Just the rice, y'all. And it's great. I hope it ain't too washed down in that. It's very creamy. Mm. Mm. I'm liking that sweet kick at the end you talking about. <laughs> oh. It's like the flavor kind of grows. Mm -hmm. Like you taste one thing, but then you taste something else. Mm -hmm. Like it don't just hit you like one note. Mm. Mm. Mm -hmm. Clean the bone palace. Not clean the bone. Let me get one of these. Go ahead. <laughs> it's also, the corn has a crema that I made. Sorry. It has a crema that I made. It has, which the crema is like a sour cream mayo, lime juice, chili powder, and cumin. And then also, I put some of the sushi on here with some katiha cheese. Mm. And, um... And uh, some cilantro. Mm -mm. Mm. 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 Got some sparkling ice, y'all. This corn talking about. Mm -mm. No, some of y'all be wanting to see what I'm drinking a lot. <sighs> Try to let it be known, but. 
Mm -hmm. Oh yeah, Extina Grubbs always raves about this ranch, White House jalapeno. So I decided to try it. To try that. If Extina is nasty, I'm telling you. I'm telling you. Uh -uh. If I don't like it, I'm gonna tell you. <laughs> Put a little bit of this. Dip a little bit of the sushi chicken in there. Mm-hmm. Mm. Very good. Mm, that's fine. For real. Mm-hmm. to order some more myself <laughs> but too, this season is really good mm -hmm. mm. you got to type in it but that's what I said earlier mm -hmm. Mm. Yes, sir. Mm -mm. Chicken everywhere. <laughs> this is good, so good. Mm hmm. Buns, buns, buns. Mm hmm. I forgot all about the rice. Mm hmm. I got your phone. Right. <laughs> mm -hmm. Oh, yes. <laughs> do you love it? Oh, yes. Oh, yes, I do. Feel my belly feeling. Okay. <laughs> yeah, mm, I ain't got nowhere. <laughs> I can eat that rice by itself. Mm hmm. I can have a meal of rice. I need to definitely. How about the cush? Uh uh. I can definitely mess this chicken up. <laughs> it's a special word. <laughs> This little crema you made to put on the corn. It's good, ain't it? Mm-hmm. It's soft. Did you just spit on me? No, it's just a corn. <laughs> God dang. <laughs> it was. I want some more chicken out, but I'm getting full. Look I know. That. I'm about to eat the other I piece. I can just pinch it. Look. Oh, God. 
Yeah. I'm about to uh, put some of this on Mike's hot honey on this other end that I know you ain't going to eat. Mm-hmm. 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 I ain't trying to eat all that. He got the whole thigh. Mm-hmm. I ain't going to make it. <laughs> Come on through, Suchi. Mm-hmm. <laughs> so good. Dry rub. Barbecue dry rub. I've been rubbed. <laughs> <laughs> I'm in rub. Rub me. Mm-hmm. Rub me, please. Go ahead and put on a different meat the next time. Mm-hmm. Oh, I got a thousand things I can do with this. <laughs> All right, AJ. So today we're going to talk about things that people do that are dumb, but everybody, mm-hmm. mostly everybody does them. Mm-hmm. So, have you ever said ow even though nothing oh, hurts? Yes. <laughs> Immediately, as soon as something happens, you be like, "Ow!" Oh, wait a minute. That ain't hurt. <laughs> all the time. I do it often. Mhm. Like if I run into a door most of the time, and I think it's gonna hurt, and it don't. I think I was doing something the other week, and I guess you anticipated it to hurt or something like that. And you talking about some ow, and I was like, "What? That did not hurt." <laughs> it like it hurt to me. <laughs> um, just what about going in a candlestick position? Mm-mm. What? Let's go read it. Going in a candlestick position in bed for no reason when you're young. What does that mean? I don't know, but I'm skipping it. <laughs> candlestick position. What is I read position and my brain went straight to the gutter, okay? <laughs> um I saw you stop. Skip. <laughs> I'm not doing that one. Um, have you ever touched a hot plate after the waiter specifically told you that it was hot? No. But I'm pretty sure a lot of people have. Yeah. I might have touched it because I'm eager. <laughs> But they be lying. What about it being hot? Oh, wait, it's really hot. Just be careful. No, it ain't be that hot. Now, if something comes sizzling in my face, I ain't trying to put my hand. Hmm. That sizzler at uh, Applebee. <laughs> yeah, you get something. I'm like, shh. Um, I'll pass. I'm going to let or you sit. Or chilies. Right, I'm going to let you sit mm, that down. Okay. But they be saying that about regular plates. Careful, it's hot. It don't be that hot. No. And, I, I, and I, how long I got awake? I'm hungry. Those do. I, I do touch those. <laughs> because it's happened so many times. Just give me that plate and go. <laughs> Stop it, AJ. Yeah, and like, get on that spin. <laughs> Have you ever used a random object as a microphone? Mm. Yes, you have. But sometimes you Sorry. we be in here. The food is taking over. I heard you, but like. Oh, I was like, I I'm know over you here. Like that. Sit over here and I'm say over you here don't do I'm that. over here in food dreamland. I'm like, mm. <laughs> yes, I do that all the time. Yes. Very often. He will pass me a brush. He don't <laughs> pass it. He just go like this. I'm just like, why can't I hold it? Yeah, unless you sing, you sing it. You sing it. Ah. You say it. We right. Do, we do more saying stuff with a fake microphone than actually <laughs> singing. All right. And I'm just like, why can't I hold my microphone? <laughs> why somebody got to put it in my face? Hey, I'm like, um, I'm like Bobby Jones. This is my mic. <laughs> okay, so don't touch my mic. If you ain't got your own, don't think Bobby going to give it up. He ain't going to give it up to you. <laughs> Go. Right. What's your name? <laughs> my name? Mm-mm. I don't give it up. Who else did that? Somebody else is like that. There's hey, corn all in my teeth. Yes, the corn got all in the mm-hmm. teeth. It was mm-hmm. good though. But you know, one thing that I've noticed is that people that don't do like a lot of public speaking 
or don't sing, when they get a mic, they hold it very odd. Yes. Like, it's almost like, <laughs> like it's, why are you doing all well, this? <laughs> yeah, you are right. It's okay. Just hold it. Just or, hold or it. Or they hold it at the very bottom, yeah. and then the top weight is, like, wanting to lean. Want like, to go. Mm -mm. Go every D well. I like holding the mic like this. What? Hold with on, your hand kind of on the... Let me show you. <sighs> show me. I like holding the mic like this. Why? I don't know. It just feels more in control. In control. Let me see. How do I hold it? Now, if you're singing this, like you don't this. cup them. You don't grip, grip them. But some people do. Some mm. people do. Hey! Ah! <laughs> <laughs> I think I do okay. like a... A baby at the bottom of the mic, like if this is the I definitely hold where a, I sing. I definitely hold a regular mic. I go mic right here, right beneath the uh, the uh, yeah, right beneath the Here's what the I head for that. Some of you be word. like this. Whoa, it's just the you can't still hold it as you normally do. <laughs> like, what are you doing? Yeah. Um, have you ever been laying in bed and held an arm up for absolutely no reason? Yes. You do a lot of stupid stuff in the bed. Mm -hmm. <laughs> you just, don't do it. No, because let me tell you something you used to do. It was odd that you don't do it now, though, because it wasn't even that many years ago. <laughs> you used to make a tent in the bed with your legs like you would, uh, like this, like an ant. What, my knees up? Yes. I still do that. Oh, I haven't seen you do it in we a while. We just haven't been in the bed. I'd be asleep. We used to be in the bed like a more. Lot. Like we would just lay there, you know. Yeah. Now, when I get in there, honey, I'm out. I'm done for the day. <laughs> yeah, you used to make tents. <laughs> Let me don't put this tent down. <laughs> um, um, have you ever started a song over in the middle of the song? Because you didn't get to hear it right like you wanted to. Yes. Because <laughs> I'll be like, what? a lot of times what will happen is... I'll be listening to something, Jim, Jim, you know, especially if you're in the car with somebody, and then they start running their mouth, bah, 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 Stop bah, and you like, yeah, bah, 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 bah. and then you like listening back, and you go back to, and then you be like, man, I missed my part, and then like, it's got to go back, it's got to go back. I did that just the other day, matter of really? fact, when you were in the store, and we were listening to an album, and then it, my part was on, but then my mother was harassing me at the moment. Hey, hey. She was FaceTiming me. No, sir. And then I was talking, and it went off, because it was getting up to that part already. And then it went off, and then I had, and then when she when we got off the phone, I was like, I said, uh -uh, let me take it on back. Let me take <laughs> it on back. <laughs> I remember I was with some friends, and Fight Night by Amigos had just came out. And I would get to the middle of the song. I start that thing up about four times. Like, I said, wait a minute. I like got to hear like it again. Like a club at the DJ. Okay. I mean, DJ at the club. <laughs> like, I needed the sound effect. Run, <laughs> run, 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 run that run that run that run that run that I would go <laughs> all the way back. I said, wait a minute. I got to hear it again. Because I think. Boom, <laughs> boom. <laughs> I think it was so different than you know what we were used it to was hype though, hearing. Yeah. yeah, what we were used to hearing. So I was like, I gotta, I gotta go back. It was and they was like, Daniel, you play this again. I, said, I gotta do it. I used to do that I a lot with to. um with uh with uh stick talk and March Madness. Oh, <laughs> you, March Madness you was my joint. Y'all, every time this man lead the gym, <laughs> bum, 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 please. Dress it up and make it real for me. Hey. Not today. Dirty told in the time phone. I used to be in my car, man. I was. I'm like, please, not today. Even if I was on the, man, let me if I was on the phone or I was in the car, I was hearing March Madness when we left I felt gym. so good riding to that song. Like that was my joint. I used to, I used to love boy. I A throw, dirty star I, I throw my um. I'm talking about hater blockers on. Uh -uh. And if it was a cool day, I rolled down my windows. Like, who's in the fall, boy? I be, boy, I rolled down my windows and I just be thumping. I be going down to uh, 150. Boy, that was my joint, boy. He be turned. If on the way to work. I did. I played it on the way to work. Because that was the only Nine, day. 9, 7 o'clock in the morning. Keep me at, no, I'm talking about like when I had to work uh -huh. night shift. Because well, you know I used to go to the gym oh, yeah. before I go to work. So then... Like on the work, on the way to work, that's the only thing to keep me in a good mood is to hear something good and really loud on the way to work. And you know, I just felt good, boy. I cleaned out my car, especially my car was cleaned out, leather conditioned in the car. <laughs> got, got you man, the got the dashboard clean, boy. Started bumping some good music, boy. Ain't nothing like 
riding in the night on a nice day with some music that you like and your car clean? Psh, what? Honey, I said if we listen to March Madness and it ain't March one more time. <laughs> All right, y'all, I'm gonna do this last one because our battery is doing something. So, have you ever not heard what someone said so you asked them to repeat themselves and you didn't hear what they said again? So you just say yes and All the time. I say, I say, oh. <laughs> and then the next thing for me normally is damn what I said oh my god it didn't work girl I didn't yeah. hear what you said yeah I do that quite often cause I be done as a, like usually I'm not it's not that I'm not paying attention I'm just distracted like I think I did it yesterday but you to be honest <laughs> I think you was trying to tell me something about something that you saw on your phone but we were watching Manifest and I was like trying to watch that and listen to you at the same time so I said uh huh and then you said uh-huh. it again but my eyes and ears were still on TV and I said huh and then I was like oh huh huh <laughs> uh, let me tell you something. Something that's not important. You ain't got to worry about me. Do- okay. Because you were laughing, and I knew it was something probably funny, and I was trying to listen, but I couldn't. There was something interesting going on on TV, too, so I was, like, trying to watch it, and I was like, oh, my brain. <laughs> okay, I got one more thing, and then I'm done. Since he talked about something about some laughing, I was thinking back. I was like, if I'm laughing at something, I can't hear nothing you saying anyway. But I don't know if y'all watched the Stella Awards this past weekend. Don't do it. <laughs> But no, <laughs> AJ, the lady Tremaine Hawkins was up there, and I said, "Where did she get that red wig from?" <laughs> and a person next to me said, <laughs> "Well, I said she like a clown," and the person next to me said, "She looks more like Ronald." And I could not stop laughing until that I lady said, came off the screen. Yes, yes it was this. Yes, yes, Ronald. It's a dig. Give me Ronald five. If Ronald got a little trim, <laughs> there was a meeting somewhere. Let me see if I can find it real quick. But yeah, but it was funny that we was. Yeah, like, I we could was, not stop Danielle laughing. Danielle cried tears until that lady went off the screen. And I then, did. I said she then, gotta go. I put the whole computer like real down. tears. And it's funny we was talking about because then all of a sudden everybody started making memes and we was just talking. We just, I said, Lord, lady, Danielle noticed that wig before she even got on the set, before even they got to her segment. Right. Oh. No, somebody said she looked like the clumps. Um, I put it in there. But, you know, <laughs> it was too much. It was too much, Tremaine. It was too much. Mm. Can't take it. Can't even Y'all, it. I'm really not trying to talk about this later. It's in all her legendary. No, because she, she's but doing like. What the wig really, really did <laughs> remind me of AJ. is when we did. The uh uh-uh. the challenge the pickles was it the, it the pickles I don't know but we had to wear something. these pink curly wigs yeah. I think it's in our intro isn't it? maybe not I don't think so but we had to wear these pink curly pickle, wigs yeah. I'll put the cart somewhere and um those wigs were from Party City but they look exactly like that one Party they were just City. pink hers looked the same way except hers was braided red. Burgundy, burgundy red. red. It was like, oh my god. It was S. Ron. It's your party. <laughs> no. I'm not doing this anymore. Who, honey? I had real tears. I could not stop laughing. Honey, I, said, I was looking like, girl. <clears throat> I'm tired of it. Pull because. It anyway. It was wrong. But yeah, anyway. We love you, Tremaine. And we love y'all. So thank y'all so much for coming out today. We really do enjoy you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. We enjoyed this food. And we definitely enjoyed Suchi's Barbecue Rub. Remember, guys, check out the description box for that information if you would like to taste this rub out. Try the recipe out I put it in the beginning of the video. I promise you will not be disappointed. Guys, if you haven't already, make sure you subscribe. Guys, give this video a thumbs up. Drop a comment down below so that we can interact with you in the comment section. Guys, remember to share this video. Share it out with everybody, anybody, everybody, your cousin, your uncle, your mama, your daddy, your sister, your brother, all them folks. Because sharing is caring, so care about us. Care, care about, about us. us. We love each and every one of you. And do you have anything else? No. Take us out of here. Bye-bye.